just want more meaning in what they consume. That that artist used their hands to make it, it was their imagination. And something about handmade goods does not lose their luster. It's always special to you and it's very individualized as well. I always loved crafting, like secretly, but it was kind of cheesy. I started sewing and meeting other artists from the area that were kind of starting to do the same thing. We were changing patterns and using funky fabrics and, and vintage things and just repurposing stuff. And it went quickly for a lot of us from a hobby to a, a small business. And from there, these shows start popping up all over the country. I think they really love Strange Hook because it is local artists. It is artists that do, um, you know, make things from repurposed materials, so that's, that's sustainability. I started playing it five years ago. It's doubled every year in attendance, and people love to shop here. We started out with 80 artists, which was really still a lot, but like I said, this whole craft thing was exploding. So now we have 125 and we get hundreds of applications and, and we have to jury them. When the, the, craft, the indie craft movement started, there were quite a few people that were like going to thrift stores and trying to find stuff to you know, upcycle. And back then upcycling wasn't even really a word yet. Okay, this is the upcycle exchange. And what we do is, is we um, ask artists to fill out an application and they make a list of all of the things that they use to craft with. And we get some really weird stuff. But, you know, they ask for it. <laughs> we compile that list and we publish it online. And so you can go online and download the list. And then we have these events uh, and mostly indie craft shows where uh, people can bring in their donations and they get a coupon uh, to get like a percentage off of their purchase from the participating artist. So I really want the Upcycle List Exchange to just be this idea. Um, that other people can use and start their own organizations. It's going to start making a difference if it hasn't already. Sorry, sorry retail, you know. This is what, this is what we're doing.